All right, so I think this is something different that I didn't do. I guess the last video was not the last video. <laughs> um, I wanted to see the musicians because I didn't remember playing the musicians. You mustn't give up. So here I am any of us ever doing wanted. the musicians you still do. thing. Your talent, your marriage, and it looks your different. Daughter. So here Neither we are. Of these went away. <laughs> the only thing the flames changed was you. You have power over yourself. Live your life. Reclaim it. Don't let your body be your cage. Your friend forever, Beatrice Gillespie. Why don't you guys say the whole fucking note? <laughs> Alright, so I'm guessing Hush, I'm the mom. I'll tell you a tale. Like the the wife of the there was painter. A man whose world wasn't pale. There was a woman who made the world sing. And they found love the most beautiful thing. I need someone to confide in. And that someone is me. I just write my own journal. Which yes, she had. She did have a journal. I remember. Need someone to confide in, cause my husband's a piece of shit. First steps. Make the first steps towards freedom. Damn! Look at all these chains. After some time, they had a child that brought light to their life, a lot of light. She loved her parents, her dolls, and her toys. And even Daddy wasn't mad at her noise. That's a beautiful piano. I bet that would be worth a lot of fucking money. Then, one day, there was a fire. It took from Mommy all her desires. She didn't know what to do with her life. Oh, ain't got no flashlight. I'll go downstairs in a minute. Is this how I looked? Oh. Man, this house always changing on me. I hate when I go into one room and then I turn around. So oh no. Time to let the light in. No. Don't give me a flashlight. That means I got to defend myself. Let me Even with these chains, you can't stop me. Even with these chains, you can't stop me. I don't know what she says in the song, but. <laughs> huh? Okay, so what happens if I keep pushing? Oh. And then push it again. I mean, it gives me the option to keep pushing it, so I'm like, why not? Okay, and then it just leads back to the boarded up door. All right, all right. Um, I guess we'll see. Let's check out the music and wheelchair door. Why 
Morphine prescription. Patient name, illegible. Date, illegible. William H. Green, M.D. Medical Disoctor. Bandages. Bandages? I think it's bandages. Oh, okay. You want me to go there? I'll go here then. Fuck it. Oh, good. More endless hallway with chains. Oh. What's that? Take it away. I can't look at it. Oh. Uh, don't try to bind me again. So am I just looking for stuff in each area? I don't need to be in here anymore. It'll just be a continuous endless hallway, probably, yeah. Hopefully. Yeah, okay, it just resets. You can even see it, like, look all weird when it resets the thing. Alright. Spin the picture again. Go through the door with hanging paintings. I hate this, but it seems simpler than playing the violin, for now. Feels like sewing myself in place, though, binding myself to my prison. What a way to think, you know? Such negative thoughts. Who's there? Hello? Who knocked? Please get oh. Out. Let me get out. Why? Oh, oh God. Leave me alone, you witch. What would I do without you? This prison would be unbearable. Uh, what, without the fucking morphine or whatever? Alright, last, last door. Oh, it's locked, bitch. Bitch. <clears throat> Where you at? Where you at, Key? Ah. Oh. Oh God. Woo. Do 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 Keep on going. Keep on going. Oh God. Let me in, bitch. Thank you. Jeez. All right, get out of here. Close that shit.
Yeah, I was like, imagine we're done here, yeah. What are you doing? I, I don't want it. Take it away. D take it away. I don't want them drugs. That big scary needle out of here. Break away the chains. Breaking free. Hey, open. Let me out. Go on oh with gosh. This. I need to break free. I need to break free. Cause I'm free. If the finger you put it on has been deformed, Free destroyed, running. does the marriage even stand a chance? Luckily, I can take refuge in music. That's when my shackles get lighter, if only for a little while. Even the gramophone helps sometimes. I feel much better after listening to some vinyls. Also seems to think it helps. Also seems to think it helps. <laughs> My house just like nothing. Just also seems. <clears throat> Who also? We thought everything we wanted to hide would fit here. How stupid we were. Today. How much did you want to hide? Damn. The bedroom door. <laughs> I started screaming, begging anyone to open. It was a good half hour before a maid showed up. I don't understand. I lock the door in the house all the time. But something about being in a room I couldn't leave was just unbearable. I feel you, girl. It's like claustrophobia. Claustrophobic shit or something. Oh. Where are we now? More chain hallways. God damn it. I can't breathe in here. I'm getting woozy. I mean, this would be scary, just being in a fucking tiny room with no door. Let me out. Let me out. What the hell? It sounds like there's a bat in here or something. Oh. Jeez. Calm down, chains. Even my instruments have their prisons. Poor instrumental prisons. Do you want to stay with me, little bird? It's safe here. Suffocating, but safe. Bird doesn't look too safe. It looks like it passed away. Maybe you want to fly away into the unknown and learn how to breathe again. Fly free, little bird. Will it be oh, better shit. Outside? Never know unless you give the bird the chance. There's nowhere to run. Ah!
back in my bedroom. Oh! Saw something in the mirror. Who's fucking with my drawers? We're messing with my drawers. Mm. Oh, long hallway again. room to run. Did I not make it last time? I feel like my life is falling apart. Everything I touch breaks. I know it now. I'm measured. My room is shrinking every day. He paints it at night and every morning the walls are this much closer. My prison grows smaller every day. Uh -huh. Stop painting the walls, you're making the room smaller. Damn, those bitches killed that guy. The painting is so bland that you have to focus to see that it's even there. Looks like the work of a person afraid to change his surroundings. Someone who's resigned and isn't willing to put himself out there. Who hates to see even his loved ones out and about and free. A man who will imprison his family just to stop them from getting better than him. What a piece of trash. Chain-destroying powers. Oh. Let me out! I want out, bitch! Let me out! Let me out of this house! I want to go! Whatever you say about this place... It had great acoustics. I could move souls. I could do anything I wanted with them. If I had them listening. This here, it was my place of power. The place of power. I am a siren, but with piano. Oh, my fucked up burnt hand. Now I can never play right again. My piano! Give me back my piano, bitch. Today after dinner, I tried to pick up the violin, and I just couldn't grasp the bow. The problem wasn't even holding it properly. It was holding it at all and not letting go. Not screaming with pain. It's like my hands are in shackles, like every finger has its own ball and chain. I can't move them properly. That sounds uncomfortable. 
She couldn't play, of course. But her dreams about music were something to behold. You evil witch. A painting as boring as this one could be conceived only by a person who doesn't feel or understand emotion anymore. A vile, heartless man, locked in a bland, boring prison. He's a failure. Guess I'll jump into the elevator shaft. Why not? Oh. Is the elevator gonna crush me? <laughs> um. I'm stuck! Don't crush me, elevator. Oh, gosh. It hurts. It hurts. I'm so sorry. God, I just wanted to stop. It will. We'll look for help. Everything will be all right. No, I, I don't want more strangers to see me like this. But I can't do this alone. I'm not a doctor. There's my work, there's our daughter. There's too much for one person. Please, darling. We need help. But the medicine helps. It isn't that bad. My body will heal. I will heal. I, I just... I need to be with my loved ones. With you. Not with the doctors. We can't let that accident... Tough decision. Live Either through the first us. conversation. Today after dinner, I tried to pick up the violin and just couldn't grasp it. Oh, okay, these are notes I collected. I'm so glad you're all doing well. Are you sure, though, that you should be planning a journey abroad already? Traveling can be exhausting, even in the best circumstances. Give yourself time to heal, please. Huh. So did the writer lady know these people? Is she writing about their no. lives? I try to think of better times. Of our engagement, of the exhibition we did together. His paintings on the walls, my music in the air. Freedom. Freedom. I started practicing again. It isn't much and is frustrating, but it feels good. He keeps telling me that I should be careful. I don't think he believes I can get better. I think he likes it that I'm locked here, in this house, in my body, with him having all the control. Piece of shit. Oh. Trapped in this house, in its body, in my head. This is where we pretended to be normal, sane, stable people. Where the shackles were the heaviest. Okay. Nothing in here that I'm seeing. Oh, there we go. More chainway hallways.
Uh, can't cut through the chains yet. The library is so much more than just a room. It's an escape. Hundreds of escape exits. As a child who needs you, I understand this is hard. I, I understand that you're in pain. But you are a mother, for God's sake. And you're the father, so take care of the kid while your wife's hand is burnt on fire. What language? Dick. I am a painter. Ugh. Check this room out real quick. Practice makes perfect. Oh, there's a door on the floor or something. What the hell? Okay, so change shit up a little bit. Let me go check that other door I didn't check back here. Might be another note in here that I need to get. Yep, right there, right there. Then give me. I don't know what you should do, but I know this. Your husband is a grown man. A grown man who swore to love you, honor you, comfort you, and keep you in sickness and in health. You know the damage the flames do better than anyone. Don't set yourself on fire to keep him warm. like how this time it didn't transcribe the your friend Beatrice Gillespie on the screen. Stairs, maybe? No way, let me check over here. When I had Sebastian, I thought I would be the best mother to ever walk the earth, and it almost killed me. With Margaret, I give myself more space to breathe, to be myself. I am happier for that, and the children seem to be happier too. Swirling. 
like melted ice cream. There's almost nothing left of her now. But I, the sadness. I knew you'd be there the in the painting, you remains. witch. But the sadness. The sadness remains. Down the stairs. Yeah, I see you. I'll get you with my flashlight, bitch. Bring it on. Bring it on. I feel like it's the house that is moving around me. Not me moving around the house. My head is spinning. shouldn't be so prominent in a three or maybe two-year-old, but I remember it clearly. The realization that the piano would do what I wanted it to. The feeling of complete control. From that day, I strived for it. Strived for control over piano or just control? Stomp, 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 stomp. Fine, don't let me in. Don't throw books at me, you jerk. Damn bookshelves. I need them to stop being me. I can't stand being me. Sky is shackled with chains. Do you remember the saying that behind every great man stands a great woman? Your husband has the bearing of a great man. But without your help, without someone who's always there for him, who keeps the home fires, he will wither and die. You proved yourself to be a strong woman. I know you have it in you to be there for him, even now. The tragedy that hurt you, hurt him too. I know you have compassion in your heart. Reach for it. Your friend and lawyer. James Jerome Sadler. Run. Oh, God. <laughs> 